one of the things I learned about you in your book is that you vowed that you will always and always have written your lyrics sober with, with a few exceptions of one or two songs. I'm curious, when you were having such a vicious cycle of addiction, was it hard to say, okay, I'm going to sit down and be sober to write this song and party after? That's a really cool question. Thanks. Um, when I write my lyrics, when I, when I was, um, you know, when I was using um, drinking and, and, and drugging, um, do you know, I, re I, I rarely used, I rarely used those, um, those chemicals for assistance in, in, in my writing. Some of my, some of my friends do, some of my friends have to get loose before they write a, a lyric, but I was always able to get, to go to that place as a place as a lyricist without any, you know, anything else to, to find the place that I need to go to. Um, what I will say, what I will say is that when I became so clean and sober, um, the clarity of my work and the better understanding of my work and the wider scope that opened up to me in my work became more pronounced. Mm -hmm. I don't think I could have written the words to the, the, the big metal opera Nostradamus if I hadn't been in this clean and sober place. Right. And, and anything else? That's a really cool question because I, I'm really proud of some of those, those songs from my pre-sober uh, pre days, you know. Yeah, the, for sure. The Sentinel, Beyond the Realms of Death. Oh God, there's so many. So but, many. But yeah, but I think that's what happens to so many of us that, that, that start this new life. We gain a lot of things. We gain a lot of things as creative people that were cluttered previously. Wow. That's, that's a really interesting point. So it sort of affects the overall body of work rather than select moments, if that's fair. Yes, it, it, that is fair. Yeah. Um, mm. It's just, um, it's a fascinating story to talk to people that have, have, are, are having almost like the second chance if you're, yeah in that creative work it, it happens to everybody but when you have to utilize part of yourself in the creative sense you 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 there's a there's a vast difference it, it it's happening you know and uh, initially you're not really aware of it until you hmm. you know you, you look at what you've done and you start to feel good about the work that you've made so it's more in hindsight yes yeah to the, to that point that that point of change um, mm -hmm. yeah uh, hindsight references reflection i think they're very very important for everything in life but, but particularly as a as someone in in music you're always um utilizing your past experiences yeah for direction for inspiration for information it's very cool for me to to look at those lyrics and to hear my voice yeah. coming from that different place 